Hey, hey. Story time. So I don't do these types of videos too often, um, but I like doing them, so maybe I'll do more or whatever. Uh, but I was recently reminded of this on X. the time I accidentally uh, broke a WW2K game and its servers. I'm referring to, of course, the great Chris Danger project of WWE 2K17. So 2K15 was the first time I did anything about Chris Danger, right? 2K16 was the first time that I really saw like a major uptick in my channel to the point where I was like, oh, this might actually like become my job now. So as 2K17 was getting ready to come out, I wanted to do something really cool with Chris Danger character, right? Because that's the whole reason my channel was gaining any sort of popularity. I wanted to do like a fun, collaborative community thing with the people that, you know, have been following and supporting me, etc. So what I did was I uploaded a blank version of Chris Danger on WW2K17. So I had my face, but I had no like gear, no attire, anything. So the idea was people would download that danger and create like a completely different backstory for the character, right? Like, give me, like I wanted lore, you know, I wanted them to look completely different. Um, and I was like, you know, whoever makes the coolest ones, you know, I'll put them in a video, whatever. Thinking that seven or eight people might actually do this. Ideally, I wanted to like download a bunch of them and put them into a Royal Rumble, right? But I was like, there's probably no way that enough people are gonna do it for me to fill up a Royal Rumble like that. So I was hoping for like maybe 10. I'm like, give me at least 10 so that I don't look like a complete asshole. <laughs> what had happened was, however, um, a lot of people did it. Probably more than should have done it. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I actually went back on Twitter and found a handful of them that people like had actually tweeted to me. And amongst those, there was even one from one of my biggest fans ever, Mr. BDE himself, Brandon. <laughs> he said, the new and improved danger. This is from October, 2016. So that was almost eight years ago. So Brandon was like 11 or something. <laughs> oh, this rules. This is Chris Danger. He grew up on the streets of Brooklyn, New York. He always dreamed of becoming an NFL football player for the Eagles. But after he got his injury in college, the doctor told him he could never play football again. So he went to basketball instead. He's slowly learning how to dunk because, you know, white people can't jump. I don't think that was necessary to put in there. But then three point shots are on point. You already know. He was then drafted to the NBA. Congrats to Christopher Chris Danger. <laughs> Oh, Brandon, you funny guy. <laughs> He's got the chain and the basketball shorts and stuff. You know, honestly, Brandon, you probably could have put a little more work into this. I'm just saying. I know you were like a child, but still. So on one hand, obviously, I was like blown away that a lot of people actually wanted to participate in this like dumb little thing. But on the other hand, um, because there was nothing but Chris Danger variations flooding the community creations, um, I started to see some negative feedback aimed towards me, and I had never experienced that before. People would comment or tweet, like, uh, I can't find what I'm looking for on community creation because it's all Chris Danger bullshit, or like, why would you do this dumb shit? You know, now the thing is broken and I can't find anybody, whatever. And that kind of made me sad at the time because I was like, I'm just, I want to do something cool for the community, blah, 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 but it like blew up into this thing, and now the game doesn't work. And now everybody's mad at me. <laughs> but let me explain to you why this is not my fault. So in 2K17, the community creation search feature function, whatever, was already busted. Completely friggin' busted. You type in like Bret Hart and your top results would be Harambe and, and like the Green Power Ranger and just all kinds of random shit. So on top of it already not working properly, now it's got this flood of dangers thrown into it. So no matter what you searched for, a bunch of dangers would pop up and you wouldn't be able to find what you wanted, essentially breaking community creations for the most part. And it required multiple patches to fix, if I recall correctly. However, that was not the worst part of it. Not for me anyway. So it then came time for me to make the video where we, you know, download a bunch of dangers. Hey, let's look at all the stuff that people posted and download some and talk about them and rate them, blah, blah. I remember Creed was at my house because this was 
a couple days after, or it might have been the day after, uh, I took my first ever wrestling bumps in my life. You can even see in the video, like, I'm beat the hell up. Uh, there's bruises on my arms, regardless of the fact that I look sickly because of how damn skinny I was, which is crazy. That's another story time video in itself, really. I really probably could do a lot of videos like this, a lot of story time type videos. Between shit that's gone down in the decade that I've been on YouTube and the stuff I did before that, we'd have endless content. Anyway, so me and Creed are downloading dangers, right? Oh, this one's cool. This is blah, blah. Oh, this one's a vampire or some shit, whatever. Then I go to download one, and this happened. I'm a little late to the game, but I'm going to do it anyway. And oh, <gasps> an error. Error. R.I.B. and B. <laughs> okay, so we're going we're gonna to. Load failed. WW2K17 save data has been corrupted. <laughs> I was like, I, I, I was like, yeah, I'm sure restarting the game's gonna fix it. 100 percent restarting the game's gonna fix it. It's just I'm a weird. Go ahead and restart the PS4, folks. Error we message. might be about to see a nervous breakdown. Here's where we find out. All of my saves were gone. All of my 2K shit was completely corrupted, which means I lost. Everything I downloaded, universe mode saves, which now wouldn't be an issue because I don't really play that. But back then I was playing it a little bit. But most importantly, I lost my my career mode progress. You're probably thinking, oh, whatever. Just a little my career. You could probably go back and just start it over again and it won't be that big of a deal, sir. This is back when my career rise, my, my career videos were not 15 episodes this is back when i was doing like hundreds of episodes per series 100 plus episodic episodes of ww2k17 2k16 whatever my career mode and out of nowhere bam gone what started as me trying to do this cool little thing for the community just a collaborative little john ended up in me breaking the game Everybody was mad at me and all my shit was gone. Why do bad things happen to good people? <laughs> Thankfully, not too long after that, I was able to get some things back up and running. They did put out a couple patches, but I, I think it was a little late. I think I'd already lost everything at that point, but they did patch and fix that afterwards. I did end up making a, I think it was like a 30 Chris Danger Royal Rumble special, which ended up being pretty cool and I like doing a lot. But I remember too, from a, from a personal standpoint, when that happened, I was like, oh, damn, something could happen completely out of my control and could, like, seriously affect the the channel and my life in, in major ways. And that was my first, like, realization of that. Because, like I said, everything before that was cool. Smooth sailing. Oh, 2K15, 2K6. Like, everything was cool. Everybody was nice, happy. Everything was great. But that was my first, like, major lesson as far as YouTube stuff goes, as far as, like, you got to be ready to pivot just in case some shit goes down. But obviously, all these years later, uh, I think things turned out all right. Uh, 2K, water under the bridge. I broke their game accidentally. They broke all my saves in retaliation. But it is what it is. So I guess we're even. That's where my head's at. I enjoyed doing this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed watching it. Um, I could do a lot more like this. Cause I got a lot of stories to tell. So I'm gonna I'm a think of some that I think can make some good videos. Also, if there's like a, if there's something that you guys also like wanna know more about, maybe if you've been watching me for a long time and you're like, oh, what about this? Or what happened there? Like, I don't know, just, whatever. Let me know, put it down below. Thank you guys for stopping by. Love you guys. No more Chris Danger projects, I promise. Or do I? Peace.